The TP-Link Archer C4000 is a wireless router that supports tri-band Wi-Fi and speeds of up to 3,200 megabits per second. It has a 1.4 GHz dual-core processor and four external antennas to provide strong and stable wireless signals. The router also has advanced security features, including a firewall, access control, and parental controls to help protect your network and keep it secure. It also has a USB port and supports file sharing and media streaming. To set up your TP-Link Archer C4000 router, follow these steps. Connect the router to your modem using an Ethernet cable. Connect the router to a power source using the supplied power adapter. Turn on the router and wait for the power LED to light up. Connect your computer or device to the router using an Ethernet cable or Wi-Fi. Open a web browser and enter the default IP address of the router, 192.168.0.1, into the address bar. When prompted, enter the default username, admin, and password, admin. Follow the on-screen instructions to complete the setup process, including setting up a new password for the router and configuring your wireless network. If you encounter any issues during the setup process, you can refer to the user manual or contact TP-Link customer support for assistance. Share files. If you have a USB hard drive or flash drive connected to the router, you can use the router's built-in file sharing feature to access the files on the drive from any device on your network. The TP-Link Archer C4000 router has advanced security features to help protect your network and keep it secure. Some of these features include firewall. The router's firewall helps to protect your network from external threats by blocking unauthorized incoming traffic. Access control. The router's access control feature allows you to set up a list of approved devices that are allowed to access your network. This helps to prevent unauthorized devices from joining your network. Parental controls. The router's parental controls allow you to set up restrictions on internet access for specific devices or users. You can block inappropriate content, set time limits, and set up a schedule for when the internet is available. Encryption. The router supports WPA2 PSK encryption to help protect your wireless network from unauthorized access. Advanced security features. The router also has additional advanced security features such as DOS attack prevention, IP slash MAC address binding, and VPN pass-through to help keep your network secure. The TP-Link Tether app is a mobile application that allows you to manage and monitor your TP-Link Archer C4000 router remotely. With the app, you can view and manage your network settings, guest network, and parental controls. You can also update the router's firmware and view real-time traffic statistics. To use the TP-Link Tether app, you will need to download it from the App Store or Google Play Store on your mobile device. Once you have installed the app, open it and follow the on-screen instructions to connect to your router. You will need to enter the router's username and password to log in. Once you are logged in, you can use the app to manage and monitor your router and network. The app has an intuitive user interface that makes it easy to navigate and use. From here you can access all of your wireless settings. If you subscribe to our channel and stay with our channel, then you will see detailed videos on all these topics very soon on our channel. The TP-Link Archer C4000 router has a feature called Smart Connect which allows the router to automatically assign devices to the best available band, 2.4 GHz or 5 GHz, based on their connection speed and signal strength. This helps to improve the overall performance of your network and ensure that devices are connected to the best possible band for their needs. If necessary, you can change the ID and password of the wireless network from here. If necessary, you can turn on and off your 5 GHz and 2 GHz networks as well as customize its channels. Here you can analyze the wireless network in detail. USB port that allows you to share files, media, and other data with devices on your network. This can be useful for sharing documents, photos, or other types of files with others on your network 
or for accessing media stored on a USB storage device from your devices. QoS with this option you can control the speed that the devices on your network will receive. From security options you can control your router from outside traffic or inside traffic. Next is the option, additional settings, NAT forwarding, port forwarding, including some more essential options. If your internet provider has provided you with IPv6 connection then you need to enable IPv6 from this option. You can easily install VPN on this router. You can install two types of VPN here, OpenVPN or PPTP. New videos will be published on this channel regularly about what option works and how to do it so that the router will support you very well. It also contains system settings, firmware upgrade, backup and restore, administration, system log, diagnostics, time and language, reboot, LED control, operation mode, If you subscribe to our channel and stay with our channel, then you will see detailed videos on all these topics very soon on our channel. Here we have tried to show details about the router if you like the video, our hard work will be worth it.